Oh, they're recording. Okay, guys, welcome to part three. Um, I'm surprised if you guys actually watched my videos. Ah, lol. But, if not, maybe it's just humoring me. Thank you. Alright, well, here's part three, and hope I don't screw up too much. Daddy, go back or be lost forever. Worse than hell. Nothing but a mess. Turn away. Nothing for you here. Young Estacado! Let's get into the church, eh? It's waiting for you in the church. <laughs> You're a lot. Shut up. Uh, that's not the church, but I'm gonna get through it. Or not. It's just time to go fuck myself. You'll find your American chum in the church. Hear it, chaps. Oh, God. You know, every British person I've talked to is not that annoying. I'm going to the church, dog. Jackie. I know he doesn't have any stitches. Jackie! Holy shit! Are you a sight for sore eyes? Listen, kid. I know there are a lot of things you're not going to understand, but you got to trust me. Now that you've arrived, I think we're going to find out what's happening here. Do I know you? My name is Tony Estacado. Okay, this is going to sound weird, but I guess that I'm your great-great-grandfather. The darkness. What the hell is it? The darkness is a living thing. It's some kind of a creature, old as time. It, it, it passes down from generation to generation, making itself known on the firstborn male's 21st birthday. What, what? what the hell is this place? Don't you see it? Everything happened here, Jackie. This is where it all began. That's why I'm back in this goddamn nightmare war. It's why we all are. I brought this darkness into our family. This is all my fault. You're an asshole. But I love you. <laughs> what do you know about the darkness? Do you know why it chose me? You're the first. I don't know. It, it needs a host, I guess. I messed up, Jackie. I brought it into the family. I didn't realize it would do this to us. Why did it bring me here? It needs its human host to stay alive. Somehow you broke the rules, Jackie. You died before your time. The darkness has to keep you here while it puts you back together. It won't allow you to die. How do I stop this? And how do I get out? Listen, there might be a way to control. I found out that a long time ago, one of the human hosts forged two special weapons that were used to control the darkness. Promise me, Jackie, that you'll go find them. You gotta work out how to control this damn thing before it's too late. I'm sick of people telling me what to do. You didn't tell me anything either. Sir, you had no arms or legs. Oh, Lord! Your fucking face is missing. Somebody get a nurse! Come. Go up to the hills, Jackie. Just keep moving and don't look back. Yes, ma'am. Don't listen to the darkness, Jackie. It'll lie to protect itself. Just keep going and don't look back. You. Don't believe it. Oh, I want to fucking believe it. Go no further, Jackie. 
couple of things about the Estacado family. One, we don't give up. There was no. <laughs> okay. You can't jump in the light again. Okay. I was wondering what the hell that noise was. I shall take your weapons. Yeah. Okay, no, you don't. You're just being an idiot.
Okay then.
Get that second one, Jackie. have been fighting for centuries to get to those hills, but you're the one who made it. <sighs> Stupid British. All right. Here's what else I know. There's this thing. The darkness keeps it heavily fortified. A cannon outside an old castle. 
A cannon? How do I get to it? There's an underground sewer system that leads to the cannon. Crowds and strange things are crawling every damn where. I think the darkness put them there for a reason. The only way is through the catacombs, right down here. Steady your rifles! Keep your eyes peeled. First thing that moves, shoot it dead. Okay, Jackie, get going and move as fast as you can. Don't look back. Get going. Wolf, wolf, freaking wolf. Close it up quickly before they catch our scent. I don't like it. Oh, this place is crawling with a damn top. This is a... Oh my god, I completely forgot I had Pokemon going on too. Just stick to your assignments, and the kid will stick to his. This is our only chance to end this thing. It's dark down there, sir. Really? There's something important here that the darkness is trying to protect. I could feel its agitation. But if I stay the course, if I defy the voices in my head and never look back, maybe up ahead I'll see the light. And maybe in that light, I'll see you, Jenny. Okay, Jenny, not to be a dick about it. But the last time you tried to defy the voices, you just watch the back. Everything you know is a lie. Your fault. The sign is here.
Somewhere, somehow, the darkness is doing whatever it can to keep me alive. Because it needs a human host. But not one that thinks and acts for itself. Like me. You are too well, Jackie. I was always on your side. Just what Jack did You should be careful of being here.
your heritage, your burden. As I slowly walk out. I'm just not focused. Your time.
hier. Come stay away from the controls! First Jenny gets murdered, your ass goes up in smoke, everyone figured Paulie blew you the fuck away. He did, Jimmy. I just came back is all. You know, your Aunt Sarah, that poor woman, that poor woman would just sit there in her Raspberry Street apartment and wait just for you, yeah, just for you to show up. You ever do one thing right in this whole mess, in this whole life of yours, you go down to the Lower East Side and you see her. You hear me? You go down to Raspberry Street and you go see your Aunt Sarah. Yes, sir. Can I which way to Raspberry Street? No where he's saw it? Well, he said there and where he's saw it. Oh, so. Don't want to go to Trinity. Reminds me of Hitman. Which, by the way, was not a bad movie at all. My Aunt Sarah. Oh, God. Now, she taught me about life. After I left the orphanage, she was the one person who cared for me. And she loved you. Now, when her husband, Jimmy Franchetti, died, the family forgot about her. Except for the older guys. And me. Yeah! Sweet Aunt Sarah. Alright. Raspberry, I am there. It should be this house, actually. <laughs> been so worried about you. I heard you were gone and I, I feared the worst. You look thin. Have you been eating? You come on inside. Come on. You want some minister on me? Hmm? Hmm? Do you? I know what's happened, Jackie. And you know how much I've always loved you. You know how I hate it when our family turns against each other like this. Yeah. Aunt Sarah. I lost her. And what the hell am I gonna do without Jenny? It's terrible. I cleaned out her apartment. She was waiting for you, Jackie. Anyone but you could see it. Oh, you should have taken her away from this place when you had the chance. And now you've got to take care of it. I'm really sorry for the way things came out, Aunt Sarah. Now you know 
that I never meant any disrespect to you and the family. But I'm gonna have to take a stand against Paulie and Eddie Schrote and punish them for what they did. I know. And some of the older men, they'll support your decision, Jackie. But you're gonna have to earn their trust. If you were to hurt Paulie's operation, they might consider joining you. They want things back the way they used to be. I'm gonna tear his face off, Aunt Sarah. Part of my language. But I'm gonna rip that dirty little motherfucker's face off and feed his lips to the fucking rats! Do it. But I can't kill that little fucking scumbag without your blessing. You know that. Well, kill is such a dirty word. But do what you have to do. Yeah, auntie. And understand <laughs> that you won't get to Paulie unless you go through his police dog first. The only way to Paulie is through Captain Eddie Schrote. Now, I happen to know oh, he has an apartment up by Gun Hill. And I spoke to Jimmy the Grape. And he's arranged for a man named Abe Hunter to let you into the building. And I suggest you go there and take up Jimmy's offer of help while you can. God, so hot. Not you. Not you, Andy. Bed. TV. Oh, let's see what's on TV. <laughs> Okay, okay. It's like, where the fuck is the front door? I thought there was supposed to be like a bunch of people over here and she was just trying to like kill her. Where the hell is Jimmy the Grape? I wasn't trying to kill some bitch. Service door across like I have everything to live for and nothing to gain. I got nothing worth having without you. But at least I got a purpose. And that's tearing Eddie Schrote into a thousand pieces. It's my reason to live. Sounds like a good reason to me. I'm not going to complain. Although I love to see how you approach this matter. So can I call anybody? Fucking 100, goddamn. Can I help you? Who the hell are you? Yeah, I'm just gonna act like I didn't see that. Canal Street, I need to go to Fulton Street. Or at least the station, anyway. Next train. Frank. All this is the screams of the dying, the cries of the dead. Human flesh, all this the screams of the dying, the cries of the dead. All this. Oh my god, just stop saying it. Email, email. Screams of the dying, cries of the dead. All this is the screams of the dying. Says the subway is dangerous. Never sat in the back right, of a here, yellow here, 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 cab, going the wrong way, way, at 90 miles an hour, through the Midtown Tunnel, with a guy who can't speak a lick of English. My buddy. Crazy. Old dude. Let's 
say you could get past this gate. You could walk all the way to the old city hall station. As long as you didn't tread on any dead hookers. <laughs> What's at city hall station? I'm trying to find my brother, Ernie. I think he went down that way. You see Ernie Devoe, you tell him his brother Mitch is waiting for him. You tell him to get his sorry ass back here. Yes, nice man. Oh, it's not gonna let me through. What's up? You're out of luck. Shut up. I can't imagine where it is. Clearly, do not know where I'm Try not to judge, but for what he did to you, both sides are as good as dead. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. Well, me making that noise just makes you know that I did not record this a long ass time ago and just uploading it now. I am, I'm just an idiot. That and I said darkness too, February, you know. But that didn't give it away. I'm gonna end this video very soon. Cause I've got a little freaky tire. Even though it's only 4.42. Well, you took your sweet time, didn't you? Shut I'm Abe Hunter. I don't know where the fuck you been. What? You hit traffic or something? All right. Schroet's up in his place. He's been there about an hour, maybe. Five will get you ten. He won't be expecting no company. Only about five people even know where he lives. Thanks for the info. Now, how do I get in? Listen. Ride up in the elevator and go straight in. Follow the stink. You can't fucking miss it. All right, here you go, pal. Okay, so you got the key to Schroet's apartment. The elevator's over there. You do know how to work an elevator, right? Pushing the buttons often has the desired effective shit. I'm, I hate you. I'm smarter than the average bear, you know. Guess what? Hey, they stopped it. Asshole. Is that? Who's up here? 
16 rockets being shot at me. I had no choice. Now get the fuck out of here. Anyone who says the subway is dangerous, oh my god, never sat in the back of a yellow it. cab going the wrong way Every time I say at that, 90 miles an hour yeah. through the midtown tunnel with a guy who can't speak a lick of English, my buddy, Crazy Abdul. Uh oh. <laughs> some old men with their dicks flapping in the breeze and their noses seriously out of joint, you know what I mean? Nope. And that little schmuck Paul, he's gone too far. He's got some fucking West Coast assholes doing all our meaningful labor. Jesus Christ, we've been earners for this family for more years than I care to remember. And now this. What do you say I put him over a barrel and show him the true spirit of family loyalty? I knew we could count on you, Jackie. You're gonna rape him. There's an entire gang of these idiots. We need you to put them in the ground, one by one. Now, the first one's been tailing your Aunt Sarah, but don't think she don't know every move he makes. <gasps> I gotta go to Aunt Sarah. Right after I call. Sounds like a plan. So where's he keeping this bag of goodies? Well, as you might expect, Eddie and his goons snag a lot of confiscated goods for themselves. They stash most of it in the old Turkish baths. It's hard to get there, though, if you don't know how. But from Fulton, there's a connection through the old City Hall station. You'll need to get past the gate between Fulton and City Hall. But Schroed's gang makes damn sure it's always locked. However, someone whispered in my ear that they keep a key hidden somewhere in the public toilets at Fulton Street Station. Okay. 
I'm off to grab Paulie and Short Fucker's piece of candy. Thanks, Butch. Be careful, Jackie. Go to the old Turkish baths and get that suitcase. Then meet me at those same public toilets at Fulton Street Station. The ones where they keep the key to the gate. I'll be waiting there for you when you come back. There's a key to a gate. <laughs> well, I need to use the woman's bathroom. I can go on that tip tonight if I wanted to. This is City Hall. You know, it used to be a subway station. But it pretty much went to hell a few years ago. It's the only way through to where I need to go. Back to the motherfuckers who killed you. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I got it. Human misery. Suffer. Disease of the mind and heart. That's the air. It's a good place to die. I kind of want to know. What the hell it is? There's a voice in the darkness. And I want to know what the hell he looks like. Trying to speak in the name. Ooh, what's that? Right, like what? Oh, yeah. He's gonna have a jackhammer. Yeah. That's great. Better go back the way you came, pal. Cops shut down the entrance of the old Turkish baths a year ago. <laughs> By special order from Captain Edward Strong. I wouldn't try going in there if I was you. The entrance is blocked besides. You don't want to get close. I don't 
Reaper, man. Damn, she's dead.
Black hole, thank god. Sorry, I got excited. Stop staring at me, thank god. God damn it. Okay, now for some reason I'm just freaking stuck. See nothing I can sneak through. I would really like to get out of here right now. Please let me out.
are you fucking- into the Turkish baths. These are the old Turkish baths. Schroth's secret warehouse full of stolen evidence. But I got a little birthday surprise waiting for me. Courtesy of good old Butcher Joyce. All I gotta do is get through half a legion of bank cops, find that suitcase, and bring it back to Butcher. Yeah. Alright. No, I'm just gonna end this video. Primarily because I can't. Alright, so thanks for watching episode 3, guys. Oh my god, that was almost an hour and 30 minutes long. It's about freaking time I ended it. Uh, yeah, I really got nothing to say, but if you actually watch this hour and 30 minute long video, thanks. I don't blame you if you stopped it, resumed it at another time. I probably would have. But thanks for watching, guys. Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, fave. I don't really care. Whatever you want, just. <sighs> no dislikes. That makes me feel bad. Yeah. So, thanks again, guys.